Hey guys, Simon and Alex here from Top Tennis Training, brought to you in partnership with Beyond Ball Tennis. In this video, we're going to cover how to kill short balls. Now, the first thing that we want to mention is recognizing the short ball is one of the most important parts of actually killing the short ball. If you see that the ball's coming short very early, you'll get there much quicker, or you'll have the chance to get there much quicker. But if you recognize that the ball's coming short quite late, a lot of players they will recognize only when the ball's passing the net that the ball is actually going to drop short and if this is something that you struggle with then first thing would be recognizing that the ball is coming short and there are drills that will help you to recognize if the ball is coming deep or short so we'll show you one drill but we have a lot of this in our instant tennis.tips course so in this drill Alex is going to either feed me a deep ball or a short ball now deep ball I'm going to classify as past the service line and a short ball inside the service box as early as possible I have to either call out deep or short. Now if it's deep, I'm gonna hit the ball back cross court. If it's a short ball, I'm gonna run in and I have the option to go down the line or cross court. So let's take a look. Short. Short. Deep. Deep. Short. Now once you get to the short ball, there are three different possibilities that you can use. And uh, the footwork is actually quite different depending on the height of ball that you're receiving on that short ball. So the first type of short ball is the low one. Something that's going to be by your knees, between your knees and, your, and the ground. Now how would you deal with this short ball, Alex? So what I'd try and do is I'd try and get there as quick as possible. I'd plant my left foot forward so I'd be in a neutral stance position. And as I hit the shot, I'm going to let my body come around, come through with my right foot in front. Now from this position, I'm able to either push forward and then go to the net, or would you push back to then recover. Now, the medium height ball, somewhere about the waist height, how would you deal with that one? So the waist height ball, you see Federer doing this quite a lot, you can use the left to left um, transition shot, so you'll go come up to the ball and you'll do a left to left and you'll continue moving forward. So this is helping Alex to stay sideways on as he hits the ball, but he's still putting his body weight in the shot. And from this, uh, from this uh, stance, you'd have to approach the net. So you'd, 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 it'd be a transition shot into the net. It's an approach shot. And the last one, the high ball, somewhere about shoulder or head height. So when it's high, I'm going to get up to the ball as quick as I can. I'm going to load from the outside leg, an open stance. I'd get my racket back and then I'd use my legs to drive up forward and land onto my left. Um, and then I can choose whether to come forward or go back depending on where I am on the court. And this is helping Alex to drive up into the ball so he can hit that higher ball aggressively. So those are the three ways to deal with a short ball. Again, the main thing is how early you recognize the ball is coming short and how quickly you get up to the short ball. But once you get there, using those three different ways, the three different stances that Alex has gone through. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the video, subscribe to our channel, leave a comment below, press the like button, and uh, hope to see you soon. Ever wondered how pros like Federer, Djokovic, and Raonic hit such good serves all the time? Well, our research shows that there are five fundamental things that nearly every pro does on their serve. And we have just released a video that breaks down these five important elements, but more importantly, how you can use these five things on your own serve. So to watch our free video, Five Steps to Serving Like a Pro, click the link under this video right now.